there is fear now. That fear was not there earlier. And that is very dangerous for democracy. I also got disillusioned with certain policies of the BJP. Jairam Ramesh used to joke that you are the, the in-house critic of NDA. And the anti-minority policies of the BJP, uh, I, I, I'm against that. And I was always against that. And I would speak out. While on politics, you were at one point Mr. Narendra Modi's points person for forging alliances in 2013 before he being, became Prime Minister. What is the current status of your relationship? And please don't say he is the Prime Minister of the country and I am a former parliamentarian. No, very frankly, we have not met each other for a long time. I don't think uh, they took very kindly to my criticism publicly and in privately in meetings of NDA. Coming to making money from a chartered accountant who had one room where the AC didn't work, the phone never rang and you had a dummy phone just for effect so that people thought there's business, to being one of the richest politicians. Take me through your story of making millions. In those days, uh, like later on, people made money in infotech or now the startups. Garments were the early uh, startups of those days. And there was, as I said, loads of money in it. The government of India used to give us so much incentives so money was just showering, you know, it was, like a, it was like rain. Since I was a chartered accountant, I could read balance sheets. So I invested in companies where uh, my money has grown uh, hundreds of times. What kind of a picture nationally do you see in 2024? 